Hi, I'm Marty Mason with Twin Disc Incorporated. We're here on Sydney Harbor in Australia today to demonstrate Twin Disc's newest marine propulsion product. It's called the Express Joystick System. It will truly revolutionize the way you're able to maneuver your boat. So come on, let's step aboard and see what it's all about. We're at the helm of the Maritimo C60 now, and let's take a look at the system. This is the new Express Joystick Control System. It is comprised of several proprietary marine propulsion products as designed and manufactured by Twin Disc. The heart or the core of the system is the quick shift marine transmissions, which are unique in their functionality and their design. They are controlled by the EC300 control system controlling the engines and the transmissions in a remarkable way. Also incorporated into the system are the BCS hydraulic proportionally controlled bow and stern thrusters as designed by Twin Disc. So the new Express joystick control system operates all of these components at the same time. Okay, let's start the engines and uh, show you how this system works. The first thing we're going to do is turn the ignition keys on to each engine. The next procedure is to press the station select button on the EC300 control head. Now we can start the engines. Currently the EC300 control lever head is the active station. There are neutral indicator lights indicating that this is the active station and it's in neutral and ready to use. For us to now use the new joystick system to maneuver the boat around, we will reach around to a station select button on the joystick. We will press it and hold it for two seconds. Let go. And now the lights are solid, indicating that this is the active station and this is an inactive station. Only one station be a joystick or lever head anywhere on the vessel is active at any one time. So the lever head now is inactive and the joystick is active and ready to use. Okay, I'm going to grab my glasses so I can see off in the distance a little better. And we're going to uh, move away from the dock very softly, very quietly with a very precise movement of the joystick. Moving the joystick in this three o'clock manner is causing the boat to react instantly and smoothly and we are just leaving the dock in a very controlled, civilized, enjoyable manner. And we still are moving in a three o'clock position on the joystick so the boat is moving to the side and now I'm ready to move forward I do not have to return to center. I can just start moving the joystick ahead, which will bring in the transmissions and propellers more. So you don't have to go back to center. Now we're, we're nicely moving at, a, at about a two o'clock angle using the transmissions and the thrusters. It's very easy at this time if you uh, want to change directions or go back to the dock to pick someone up you may have left just to, to rotate the joystick. So there's always the ability to have a, a fluent motion without going back to center. And again, once you uh, come out of your rotation uh, without really going back to center, start easing it ahead to move in the direction you choose. And even while we're now in forward, you don't need the steering. We're not interfaced to the steering. I can rotate it while we're moving forward and steer the boat with the joystick. So we're not, we're not interfaced with the steering at all, not using the rudders, yet we're able to maneuver the boat by rotating the joystick while we're moving forward. We 
We're coming to starboard at this time with a little clockwise rotation. Without going back to center, I'm going to move it ahead now. So moving the joystick ahead engages both transmissions to move the boat in the forward direction. And if I choose to move to the port a little bit, I can give it a little counterclockwise rotation. And it's just like turning the steering wheel in your car. The boat maneuvers perfectly. So we're able to rotate the joystick at the same time that we're moving it ahead to steer the boat. Very precise movements, doesn't take a lot of effort, and the boat just responds very, very smoothly, but instantly, without any delay. All right, we've uh, enjoyed maneuvering through some tightly uh, moored sailboats to show you the flexibility of the express joystick system. Uh, this Maritimo C60 is equipped with three joysticks on the boat. There's two in the cockpit, so we have a port and starboard wing station. And since we have a port two lie to the dock uh, and we're on the starboard side of the boat, we're gonna move to the cockpit now and activate uh, the port express joystick control station so we have better visibility to see the, to how to dock the boat on that side of the, of the vessel. Okay, uh, we're now at the port wing station of the express joystick on the Maritimo C60. We're going to press and hold the button as we uh, saw earlier. The red lights will blink. The station is now active. Obviously we have good visibility back here the side of the boat and we're going to start transitioning the joystick in the direction that we choose. We're easing ahead a little bit with both transmissions and forward. little counterclockwise rotation. Very easy, very manageable. We're gonna give a little clockwise rotation to bring the bow around, bring the stern in. And we're pretty much lined up. We're just gonna bring the stern in a little more. Very small movements. Not a lot of, not a lot of uh, movement required. We're lined up with the dock now. I'm just gonna slide to the side. about a foot off the dock now. We're going to just uh, very softly make contact. Okay, so that shows you how simple and easy it is to bring the boat to the dock with the joystick. Let's move it away now and show you how easy it is from this cockpit station. Using the express joystick system makes difficult maneuvers like backing into a narrow berth simple.
Another benefit of the express joystick system is its ability to move the boat very slowly and very precisely with very little effort at the joystick. We've got a, a pretty strong breeze blowing through here today and then the current's trying to move the boat, but it's very easily dealt with with the joystick system. This allows us to back up to the dock at this time and allow some guests to, to step off onto the floating dock or to step off the floating dock onto the boat, either way. Or if we wanted to back up to another boat swim platform, it'd be easy for passengers to uh, move from one vessel to the other. This is a 60-foot Maritima. It's a big boat in the wind and the current, yet we're able to control this boat as if it was a feather floating on the water. It's, it's that controllable, it's that easy. We've demonstrated some very challenging docking and maneuvering situations today. We hope you've learned just how advantageous and enjoyable it would be to have this joystick system on your next boat. For more information, please contact Twin Disc Incorporated. <laughs>